Hello guys and welcome back to another video. So, today I have a bunch of books. I got a bunch of cool stuff here that I got in the mail. Uh, went to the comic book shop, bought a couple books. Um, it is my one day off, so I'm kind of just relaxing. Thought I'd make a video, maybe make two. We'll see. But um, I had made a previous video unboxing these things, but it took too long. So I scrapped it. It's all unboxed. I already know what I got. I want to show you guys what I got. And uh, yeah, I have some pretty cool stuff. So we'll start off with the stuff I got at the comic book shop. Nothing too crazy. Um, new comic book day was yesterday. So, and I was working, so I couldn't pick anything up. Got it today. We have Static Season 1. I guess you're going with Seasons, I don't know. But really cool cover, uh, variant cover of his old costume. So that was pretty cool. Next one, we have another variant. Um, I already have this book, but don't have the cover. They still had it from last week. So I was like, you know what? Let's pick it up. Nice House on the Lake, number one. This book is kind of blowing up too. Um, I haven't read it yet. I'll read it tonight though. I'll read it today. But... I've heard a lot of good things about nice the nice how to the nice house on the lake number one. So I'll be definitely reading it today. Next one we have Heroes Reborn number seven. Um, this does have Moon Knight in it, and uh, his uh, costume is. Um, I really don't know what they were thinking with his costume, but. Um, it's like all black with like one, like a moon and then like weird hands like gloves. I don't know. It's like f it looks like flaming gloves. I don't I don't know what they were trying to get at. But um, they do have a really cool cover of uh, Hyperion. And I just got a book of. I'm not gonna say it. I don't want to spoil it. But yeah. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then the last one is uh, Jupiter's Legacy Requiem. This really cool variant cover, not too bad. Um, Six dollars for image, it's a little steep, you know, but hopefully it's a good read. So, uh, I still need to watch the uh, show, by the way. Maybe I'll watch that today. All right, guys. So the next up is the books I got. Some pretty sweet books. First one is Doctor Strange number thirteen. This is the first appearance of the one above all. Really cool cover, you know, wasn't really expensive, and so I was like, you know what, considering the cosmic side of the MCU, maybe one day we'll see the one above all, but pretty cool character, so why not? Next one we have West of Ki oh, the West, can't talk today guys, the West Coast Avengers number 21. This is uh, when Moon Knight joins the West Coast Avengers. A really cool black cover with uh, Moon Knight. Uh, he's like prope propelling down, swinging down with his rope. And you got uh, Dr. Pym as well. Uh, they both join the West Coast Avengers. And mark another Moon Knight appearance off the list. And we'll mark off another one. Actually, two more. Three more. We have... Punisher Annual number two. Now this book I overpaid. This book is easily a five dollar book, five ten dollar maybe. But I end up paying more because for some reason this book is getting a little hot. There are rumors that John Berthold would Berthold Berthold would be in the new Moon Knight series, but it's just rumors and rumors start and then books start to get hot and more expensive and I get sad so really clean copy too though actually really that's a really nice copy I didn't realize how good this is this could be not bad so all right and second to last book we have here infinity wars number three you guys don't know what this is this is the first appearance of arc Knight. Arc Knight. It's a combination of Spider-Man and Moon Knight. Um, why didn't they just call it Spider Knight? <laughs> I don't know. but uh, This is a pretty cool book. Pretty cheap. And uh, it's just one of those characters that are really... And they have the Funko Pop for it. So 
Maybe I need to get the Funko Pop next, but... Um, one of those obscure characters, you know, that you don't really hear too much often, if that. But, another one off the list. And the final one, the final book. This book right here is a personal grail. Um, people say don't, you know, people throw grail words, you know, the word grail too often. But, this right here is a big, big big book i mean it's pretty big in size but um it's a magazine and it's hulk number 13. you guys don't know what hulk 13 is well for you people who don't know this is the first time bill sinkowitz sinkowitz yeah sinkowitz, uh drew moon knight and you guys know who Bill Sinkowitz is. He's a legendary Moon Knight uh, artist. And this is the first time he's ever drawn in this. Published. Big book. If you're a Moon Knight fan, you, this is a must. No doubt. And it's really clean too, man. Um, I have another whole, I, I have another magazine that has another first, but, you know... This right here is like the coup de gras, like the granddaddy. And I got it for a really solid price too. This book is going for like 150, 200 bucks. Maybe you can find it for like 80 or 90, but I got it for a really good price, so. Oof. Beautiful. One off the list. All right, last thing folks. Um, Last one, this is freaking cool, man. I've been waiting for this. I have been looking for this, like, not on eBay, but, like, in stores. Can't find it ever. But shout out to Post Underdash Raymond. Um, he came in the clutch, and that dude is a real pal. I mean, I've never met this guy. You know, simply just talking on uh, Instagram. And for him to get this for me, you know, Taking his time out of the day to go and look for it is absolutely wonderful. And the fact that when he bought the one that he bought, um, had like the tape missing, he swapped it out with his. So, I mean, that dude is just such a good guy. Go follow him on Instagram. You won't, you don't meet many dudes like that. Um, so shout out to him because, I mean, this thing is just awesome. So, we have here Marvel Legends Moon Knight. Yes, guys, I finally got this. Um, there's two versions, so I'll have to get the other one. But this right here is just... It's beauty. It's a beauty, it's a beauty man. Um, this is my first ever Lar uh, Marvel Legends uh, figure. And I want to get more, so... Man. This is so freaking cool. Like, this is so awesome, man. I... I can't, I'm going to keep it in the box, I'm going to, because this right here, oh yeah, so Ramon, or Raymond, sorry if I but, if I butchered the pronouncing, but, pronunciation, but shout out to you man, this, this made my, this made my month man, this, this is so cool, so that's it for this video guys, um, one thing there is going to be, um, Big thing tomorrow, Scott the Scott Williams cover will be available tomorrow with the EM the Gist cover as well. I'm going to be staying up probably most of the night into the morning uh, because I do not want to miss a single minute because I need these books. These two covers, one is limited to 600, one is to 800 I think or 900. Either way, they're very limited. And if I don't get them now, they're going to be worth, they're going to be priced out a stupid amount of money and I'm not going to pay for it. So, um, that's what I'll be doing tomorrow. And if I get it, I will be giving away possibly the guest cover. So we'll see, but that's it for this video guys. I do appreciate it. Shout out to everyone, um, who's followed me, you know, 2000 plus followers is absolutely insane now. Uh, let's get to 3000 and <laughs> Yeah, so thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys later.